going on because your flesh is trying to tell you you'll never be able to achieve that you'll never be able to reach that you'll never be able to do that but the spirit is saying come on the spirit is ahead the spirit is not there the spirit said yes you can I'm already here come on up here who and I'm talking to and sometimes people in the flesh who's not spiritual minded will stand in your way they, the, the enemy will send people on an assignment to tell you, you can't do that. that. That ain't never been done before. But God said, I can do all things through Christ that strengthen me. In the flesh, I might can't do it. But in the spirit, I can do it. Touch somebody. I'm talking about 15 to 20 of us. You're close to it. You, you're close to it. Why? Because there's vision and revelation in you. God himself has put it in you. But we can't allow to give to deter us from our promise. There are certain things that God has promised us and we thank God for the gift, but the gift is not it. It's bigger than the gift. Somebody say it's bigger than the gift. Let me prove it to you. Just a few points, and I'm going home. Point number one, Hebrews 10 and 35. Somebody just scream, I'm close to it. Come on, scream one more time. I'm close to it. Somebody's so close in here, you almost can taste it. You, you know, God, you've been struggling, you've been wrestling with some things, but, but yet and still, you're determined, you're, you're yet persuaded, you're yet holding on, you're yet believing God. Who am I talking to? God has showed you the sun. But you're in the darkest 